Can yeah. we talk about what we learned this past year while we've been waiting? Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, one, two, three. Don't forget to laugh every day. <laughs> Good morning. Um, we are awake this morning. Mom and Rachel are so super helpful. They went down in the basement this morning and started sorting out, like getting all the kitchen stuff together. And um, yeah, and that was while I was doing my vest. And so it's awesome and very very helpful and I'm very thankful um, I just hooked up to my IV took some Zofran and Oliver and I are just laying here and mom and Rachel went to go get some lunch and Peter's working over at the church getting the recording stuff set up and um, yeah our day is moving along I'm gonna rest for a little bit my head is hurting and um, I just need to rest so that's what I'm gonna do and then um, mom said she found some curtain rods downstairs in the basement so hopefully maybe we can um, remedy this situation today maybe <laughs> we'll see look who's back I'm back I went over to the church and I was working on some audio and getting the video recording ready I think I think we're all set for I did a trial run of recording video and... I'm gonna go check my phone in case mom texted. Okay, sounds good. So, hopefully on Monday I'll have the sermon up on my channel and while these fun girls are hanging out today I'm working on finishing up my sermon. So, that's what's up. Well, hi guys. Um, I w took a nap. I wasn't feeling great. Um, headache, just not feeling great. So I went up, took a bath, and then got into bed and I ended up sleeping for like, I don't know, an hour or two. <clears throat> Peter was off working on his sermon and now he is bringing dinner back for us. And um, I'm seeing some gorgeous, clouds that you guys probably will want to see oh so pretty um yeah so anyway <clears throat> i'm feeling better now that i'm awake and i'm feeling ready for some dinner rachel and my mom oh, are amazing and i will show you some of the things they got done already today we put some stuff in here so far. I don't even remember this. I think I got it on clearance at TJ Maxx. I'll have to ask Peter. Um, but just like some of our fun stuff, you guys recognize these. This is what Rachel gave me for my birthday. <clears throat> yeah, so um, starting to make our place home. And we just um, got the spice jars ready. They're drying now, and then we will put all the spices in there. And I'm so excited. So excited. Whoop, whoop. Holy moly. In there, do you want to just... No, I think it's good. Thank you, Mama. Now I am filming. <laughs> oh, stop it. <laughs> I had the camera out right as she was coming to the top of the stairs, so I turned it off. And then she was like, oh, I thought you were filming. And I said, oh, sorry, I turned it off. And then I turned it back on. Does that smell good, Ollie? Do you remember that from our previous life? <laughs> yeah, I think that's good. And then we can just pull it over when we want to put our feet on it. Look who's home. Oh, hi, guys. And so he doesn't remember this either. Yeah. But it's nice, it's right? It's so fun. It's fun to see all this stuff. Stop. Stop. Okay, let's right. eat some Got food. Some, some miso soup, some wonton soup, and some food. Ooh, the sky is blue, the sun is setting, 
and Peter and I are on our way to the grocery store. Whoop, whoop. We had our dinner, it was delicious. Thank you, baby. Yes, you're welcome. I thought that we'd get a clearing oh. to show the sky. Let the sky fall. <laughs> Ah, uh, this is our life. Fruit. Check. 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 We went to the indoor. Well, you always drive on the right side of the road, but then they always have the exit on the left. Look what I came home to. How gorgeous are these? Mom and Rachel filled these up. And they are so pretty. Oh! We're home. Guess what? What? Look. <gasps> All of our spices. Don't those look cool? They do look cool. Now we just have to find a label maker so we know what they are. Oh, uh, yeah. Do we have a label maker? Yeah. Somewhere. Somewhere. I couldn't tell from the glare if you were looking at me. Oh, I have really good news. Um, so between moving our stuff from Maryland to the new house and also having stuff at the old house and then going in the hospital, we have not been able to find his hair clippers. And if you know me, I like to have his hair clipped at a half inch and if I had all the energy and time in the world, camera died, you're back. Basically, um, if I had my way, I would shave him like every other week or something, but it takes a lot of energy and a lot of time, so we do it about once a month or every six weeks, and um, he's like overdue because the clippers were missing and I was in the hospital and all of that, so we just found the clippers. So in the next few days, here wait, let me put it on your nose. Ready? Get it. Oh, almost. Um, in the next few days. Nice. Yeah. Oh wait, do we still have to get a new, we should order a new blade, because remember this oh, one. Oh yeah, one? we aren't quite sure what the problem is. So, anyway. You got a bruise there on your I think I ran into a door. Oh, that happened. <laughs> that happens more than you would think. Mm, that's funny. Um, so, anyway, yeah, I did some yoga. That felt good. And, oh, do you think I could have a little kiss? I'd love to have a little kiss. A little kiss on my lips. A big one. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I think he wants a kiss. I just finished up getting ready for church service tomorrow and excited about that. Did you get a real kiss? I didn't get a real kiss. Go give Peter a kiss. Oh, oh. <laughs> that was a real kiss. <laughs> wow. No dog, no slobber. Can you wait to the people? Oh, thank you. Oh, yes. <laughs> I want to see your this belly. One. This one. Your belly? He doesn't want me to rub. Rub your belly? Oh, there oh, you there go. You go. <laughs> <laughs> He's cute. And I want to show you guys the end result of the spices. Look. So I'm not exactly sure how we're going to do it, but I think for now we're going to leave it in this little container. Whenever we're making food, we just pull the spices down. And for now, we just have little paper labels on the top. And whenever I find our label maker, I'll print real ones out. But for now, these will do just wonderfully. So I'm really excited. I think these will work out well. And then I made a tiny little bowl of salt, like really tiny. So how big is that? Like an inch and a half, two inches? And then this tiny spoon from Scotland. Oh, it's so cute. It's Himalayan pink salt. So, 
I'm pretty excited about the kitchen coming together. Um, the oven and the stove are brand new. Oops, I don't know what I was filming. Um, it's brand new and I haven't used it yet. So hopefully soon I'll start making some food. And um, yeah. Things are coming together. It's so fun. We're loving our new home and yeah, it's a fun process. It is fun. It's been a long time coming. It's yeah. quite the process. Yeah. But each step we learn stuff. I think probably the biggest things we were learning this year were, let's say, the uh, two things come to my mind. Okay. So it's like the newlywed game. So let's see what you were learning, what I was you, learning. Uh, wait, can I clarify? Yeah. We're talking about what we learned this past year while we've been waiting. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. Contentment. Patience. And what was your second one? Contentment. I didn't have a second one oh, yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> I had patience and contentment. So okay. we were on the same yeah. track for sure. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know, there's... It was a lot of applying to jobs, having interviews, and then there's the other part of the process, which is waiting on the Lord and finding out what He wants. Yeah. And um, we feel really grateful for where He's brought us, and we're excited. And yeah, um, and I think one of the things we've just realized over and over is like our God is a creative God, and often his plan is different than we may have once envisioned and yeah he's able to use unique things like us talking to you guys through the crazy thing of youtube and um allowing us to share our lives with you and to be able to have the blessing of earning an income from this and um it's it's been an amazing journey and um our God is a creative God, for sure. Yeah. I was thinking about the verse, um, delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires of your heart. And I was thinking, a lot of times, I feel like the focus goes on the second part of the verse, which is, and he will give you the desires of your heart. But I realized, as humans, we should probably focus on the first part, delight yourself in the Lord. Yeah. And when we're doing that, our desires will probably align with his yeah. and I don't know it just kind of struck me the other day like I think we're a lot of times focused on that second part like okay I'm choosing to delight myself why am I not you know getting the things I want it's or not a, it's not a so that you get right. the desires of your heart right it's, when you delight yourself in the Lord, then your desires will be in line with His. So, yeah. And I mean, I can't say that that means that, um, well, number one, that doesn't mean that we've accomplished that or that we've mastered that. Yeah. It just means that that's something that we're striving for. Um, but secondly, it doesn't mean that we don't still have desires or like, Sometimes we have desires in life and we're like, oh, I'd love to move out or move into a new place or um, save up for a car. You know, those desires are good. It doesn't mean that you shouldn't work toward things. It's just, um, the, you know, The focus in life needs to be that first part of the verse. Delight right. yourself in the Lord. And that, I mean, that's, that's just where Mary and I find our peace and contentment and joy in this world is delighting ourselves in Jesus and yeah. so I didn't what, know we were gonna have deep thoughts with Mary I and know, Peter but you asked me what we've learned this past year and yeah that's a lot yeah I feel like a little weird with my arm around you yeah but that's where it landed <laughs> be where your arm lands it's a new t-shirt we're gonna be releasing here soon <laughs> be where your arm lands. not really <laughs> end of the night well, guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Thanks. And as as always, always, we, we will, will see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Good night. I was so scared because I'm like, I just want to go to the dollar store, but if I get a cold, I'm going to be in the hospital. I'm going to, oh, and there's nothing I can do about it.